Okay. Yeah, what is what? Uh, mm-hmm. My my opinion is um okay, they can go ahead yeah. with the land conference. Yeah. Um uh, and uh, I just wish that it's going to end amicably and I really think that it's necessary mm. uh for them to go ahead with the conference so that they can come to a particular understanding okay. about this whole issue and yeah, so that everybody might actually be satisfied okay and then w- w- what are your opinions on the call of on, on the call of uh, for instance for ancestral land that's becoming ever since that's becoming uh, ever so louder day to day okay uh, for me if uh, people to call for ancestral land for me i don't think that it's going to solve any uh, issues that they have for land and i don't actually understand why they are calling for ancestral land Mm. I just don't understand because I think we are in an era mm. that has really evolved mm. and um, some of the things they just think that are, that they are very unnecessary and for me even the population density in Namibia per square meter is very low mm. and I think that each one of us can have land anywhere. We don't really need ancestral land. Mm. I, I, in, I'm in support for land um, uh, uh, a reclamation mm. rather than us calling for ancestral land i just don't see any need of calling for ancestral land so in other words you would believe that uh, we should re- we should share the country's resources equally amongst ourselves no 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 i i okay we we, we have to share it mm. amongst ourselves but i still think that namibia has namibia has got abundant land mm. we don't really need to go and take any other person's land or we don't need to go and call for any ancestral land and apart from that i just don't think that it's clearly documented because mm. that time of our ancestors mm. really uh documenting things and everything was something uh that they really didn't do very well so uh, at the end of the day we will end up claiming land that we are not even sure whether it's ours or it's not ours i think anita has got vast land that is unoccupied and everybody can get that land rather than claiming ancestral land mm-hmm. so if one was to say so uh, d- so do you believe that the calls uh, do hold any basis or they are just unnecessary rhetoric that's happening no, 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 it's very unnecessary. I, I don't think that they hold any basis. And I think it's going to end up in a very huge debate, uh, which is meaningless and useless. And I don't think that any solution will, will come up from all this. Okay. So what do you think of the resettlement process that's currently happening in the country? Do you think that it is fine the way it is or it needs to be changed or we need to completely scrap it and come up with something better and bigger? No, uh, resettlement, resettlement is, is, is a good, uh, is a good initiative. Mm. I think that it is a good re- initiative. Mm. Uh, even though I do think that most of the farmers that uh, got land through the resettlement process, at least those that I've seen, they have not used the land to their fullest potential. And if, as long as we don't use land uh, to the fullest potential, no. we will really not achieve. Uh, the goals of this resettlement uh, mm. land. We are not going to achieve it because we are resettled so that we can productively use the land, of which we don't. Most of the farmers have deteriorated and they are not used for anything commercial. Mm. Most farms are commercial farms, but we don't use them for that purpose. What is the purpose of having a farm if we don't use it for commercial purposes? Yeah, so maybe. I really, it's a good initiative, mm. but I think that farmers don't use it for the purpose that it's supposed to be used for. Okay, now that's a that's that's a very good point, and it's true. Um, w- mm-hmm. What what are you hoping would come from this uh, second land conference? What are your hopes and aspiration would come from this that would sort out the land issues in this country? What are you possibly holding your fingers crossed for? If uh, if I if I could see that this, I, if, okay, my hope is that uh, people are sensitized mm. about better use of land mm. people are sensitized about the fact that it's not only going to grab land and claiming land mm. that is necessary but there are other processes that we can do we can also reclaim land and use that land productively mm. rather than going to 
claim unnecessary land. And some of the places that we are claiming, after all, they are very arid areas that don't even have farming potential in the first place. Mm -hmm. They are vast areas in Namibia that are having a great, great farming potential. Mm. I, would, I, would, I, would, I hope that ideas of reclamation and rebuilding lands and, uh, will be uh, also told, uh, 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 addressed mm. and people will also be told about other ways of getting land rather than this thing of claiming land. I don't know from who. Okay, okay. Now, Uno, you know, thanks very much for taking the time to uh, share your opinions and your views on this and uh, really hoping that what you said today uh, will reach the ears of the relevant people and uh, what you the opinions you put forward would also be taken into consideration. So thanks very much. Mm -hmm. Thanks very much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Huh? Bye. Bye.